Hey, welcome to my sacred laundry room. So today I want to talk about my leggings. These are leggings my granddaughter made, Isabel Olson, and she works for a company called Bombsheller, which is um, a really interesting uh, company right here in, based in Seattle. And uh, what they do is they take designs for um, you know, any kind of art design. These are called art leggings. And um, you can submit your own designs or you can purchase uh, the leggings with their designs on them. And these are designed, this is a, a legging that she made. Um, she made the design. And so it's just a lot of fun. People love leggings. And so I've been having fun with these leggings because they're kind of flashy. Everybody seems to like them. And they're great for yoga. And uh, it's really fun when um, people can apply their own creativity uh, and make a business out of it. So that's what Dean and I have done since uh, 1979. We've been creating our music. And um, it started off with simple little things like making cassettes. And we'd sell 10 cassettes a weekend in a swap meet in Tucson, Arizona. And then gradually we maybe sold 20. And then on and on it went until finally we made uh, CDs and then we got distribution and we have uh, distributors and all the wonderful stores around the country and around the world and online and so you know by just persevering and following your dream uh, you can create um, a source of income that can benefit you and others so I just encourage everyone um, to take some time. If you're not already there and you're kind of wondering, just pedal in there, um, you know, just kind of meditate and uh, take some time to um, think about what you love to do. What do you love to do? Um, what's your favorite thing? What makes you happy? What lights you up? And then um, just start looking at that and uh, thinking about how that could become a an aspect of um, a business or it could contribute to someone else's business and you could use your talents and skills and your creativity to um, enhance your own life and to enhance the lives of others. And I think the more that um, when we tie in our um, creativity and then our daily practice and our intention, our commitment, um, there's nothing we can't accomplish. So follow your dreams. Find out what makes you tick, what makes you happy, how can you serve people, how can you share what it is that you have, what are your innate gifts, and uh, and send me a, send, uh, come on to my blog, uh, healthylivingdreams.com. I'd love to hear ideas you have for uh, manifesting your own dreams and living the life you love. So, thanks for dropping by, and come back and see me soon.